I was 12 years old. Started out with weed and alcohol. Um, progressed from pills to heroin, meth, really anything. I couldn't even go five minutes without getting high. Like I was always so concerned on how I was gonna get my next high or did I have you know, the drugs to get me high or what I was gonna have to do to get those drugs to get my next high. And uh, that's not my life today. What was it at 27 years old that you said, I need to stop? I was at a complete low. I would go through withdrawals, which I would have rather been dead than go through a withdrawal coming off heroin. The shakes, the cold sweats, the throw ups, just the whole detox, the restless legs. Um, like I said, I really felt like death would have been better than actually having to come off the drug itself. I went to a program of recovery and I applied myself 100% and I was just so determined to learn and actually live a life without using drugs or drinking anymore. You know, going into the schools has been the best experience of my life, you know what I mean? Because I get to see these kids' reactions, like I get to see who I was at that age and um, I didn't trust anybody. I didn't want to open up and talk about my problems, nor did I even think that I have, that I had a problem. And um, these kids today will come up to me crying afterwards and just like want to give me a hug and ask me, you know, like I'll never forget this one kid. They came up to me and they're like, my uncle sleeps in our shed and he won't stop drinking. And like, what can I do to get him to stop drinking? And, you know, I look at that kid and I can't help but you know, I have nothing but admiration because you know there's obviously something about me that is giving these kids some sort of trust, and um, you know that's what I try when I go into the school. That's what I want to be is somebody who I needed at that age.